Why am I so positive all the time? Let's get into it. Hey everybody and welcome back to another episode of Walk With Me. This is Josh here and today we're talking about my positivity. This is something that comes up from time to time in my real life or in you know the social media DMs. So I wanted to take some time to clarify, you know, good or bad, there are a lot of things in our lives that we don't have any control over. There is definitely no doubt things in my life can be difficult and they can be exhausting and they can be stressful. And there are a lot of things that I just don't have any control over. Obviously, this is gonna be the same for everybody, but the, uh, the way I choose to look at it and the way I choose to see it, you know, I might not have control over those negative things, but I do have control over how I choose to perceive them and how I choose to react. You know, it's easy to get swept up in a school or a workplace full of negative people that just wanna complain about everything and focus on the negatives. There are always going to be positives and good things to focus on. The good versus bad percentages might change over time, but there's always going to be a positive outlook you can take in any given situation, or at least not a negative one. And that's just the way I always try and choose to be. This is 100% a learned skill, so if you're thinking, you know, I don't think I could ever get to that point in my life, I was never in this spot either. Um, it's something that's learned and practiced over time, and obviously still a work in progress for me too. And you can't get swept up into that negative hive mind of the people that are just trying to bring themselves down and bring everyone else down with them. And there's a good chance you'll get a lot of resistance and a lot of flack from some people in your life, but that's, um, that's nothing you should really be worrying about. You need to focus on yourself and focus on being happy and being positive and uh, appreciating the good things in your life. Keep in mind, you're in control of how you react to any situation, regardless of how positive or negative. So react the way that you want to feel. So hopefully this can serve as a little bit of clarification if you're ever wondering why I stay so positive. You know, things in my life obviously aren't perfect all the time. For as many of those negative things that exist, there are just as many, if not more positive things. So that's always what I'm gonna choose to focus on. But that is gonna be it for the main topic today. I did have a couple of other things I wanted to bring up and talk about. I really wanna set up a group hike here in Portland. I would love to know how many of you are in town or near town and would be willing to travel and do a group hike. I think this would be a really fun idea for all of us. If we can get enough people, I'd love to get that set up. I think it'd be a lot of fun. The, uh, the other thing though that I wanted to bring up, if, uh, if you haven't yet, go sign up for the newsletter, BFL Monthly. The new issue will be coming out Saturday after this comes out. It's always on the first of every month. So if you haven't yet, sign up. I greatly appreciate it. It's been a fun little side project that I've been working on for the last year and a half or so now. It's just things that I see around the internet that I think would be of interest to you. Whether it was a podcast episode I heard that was really great or a new TV show I'm watching or a new YouTuber I just found out about. Um, so check that out if that's any interest to you. And as usual, be sure to subscribe if you're not already. Walk With Me comes out every Monday. All sorts of other videos come out every Friday. And I'd love to hear your thoughts on this topic as a whole, so leave a comment down below. Let's get a good discussion going. But until next time, I'll talk to y'all later. Have a good one.